up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. This guy has truly made the takedown a thing of beauty in mixed martial arts with respect to yourself and George St. Pierre and the truly great takedown artists. This guy's closing the gap and, and entering that company in the eyes of men. Oh, absolutely, because he's done such a great job of timing takedowns. You didn't see, I haven't seen anyone so good at slipping a jab into a takedown since George St. Pierre. Right. He does a phenomenal job of getting from step one to step two before his opponent even realizes, now he's in on my leg. And if they do get their hips back, immediately he's up into a foot sweep, or a headlock, or an inside trip. It's just so many different ways for him to get you to the floor that he will throw every single one at you every single time. And a lot of fighters talk about that wrestling maintenance and how hard it is, right, over the course of a career to continue to drill those things. He talks a lot about that, and that's why he's continued to realize success here in the UFC. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 180 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Bo Crusher. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves is making it how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's gonna be the one that's gonna control where this fight takes place? DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Nice punch by Lee. He is all about that left kick to the body. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Nice one, two there. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Whoa! 
Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to oh. take that finish down. Now. That one just goes to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ah, oh, that jab hurt him. Look at him drive his shin into his own body with that body kick. Both of these gentlemen are putting it on the line. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, nice inside kick. Continues to throw that inside leg kick. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Nice straight punch. Back and forth we go here. One of those knees to the body. Throwing hard in the pocket. Oh, straight right. Plus right hand is true. And there comes the separation now. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. Nice defense there, huge block. Right hand on point. Oh, Superman punch. So he lands another strike here to his opponent's liver. The defense has got to do something at this point in time. He was buckled with a similar shot earlier in the fight. Got the single collar tie. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. There's the shot. There's the takedown by Lee. Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. with the uppercut. Real sneaky body kick. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Beautiful body kick. Well, man, has he come out with a point to prove tonight. Aggressive right out of the shoot and really has landed at a pretty high clip here in this first round. Technical, but also aggressive and accurate. A very good start for him here tonight. Oh, and now his opponent in a roll of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him. He's coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. 15 seconds remain in the round. Effective punch there by Lee. Second round, straight ahead. Not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. Just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Body kick is blocked. 
he's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Kick to that lead leg. Oh! Wow! Oh! Huge knee to the head. He could be in trouble here. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Oh, nice strike landed there by Lee. Yeah, hurt him a little bit. Oh, super man. Punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may blow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into the strike. Big head kick lands. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Well, that won't feel good in the morning. Big uppercut. Oh, and there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Try to establish that jab. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Strong straight left there. Oh, nice. Good punch land. Ooh, blocks the shot. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! He got it! Just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 27 seconds of round number two. We're playing the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon. So there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time.